Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen. What is going on, YouTube? How's everybody doing this evening? We're looking at, uh, yeah, it's quarter after eight here in South Jersey. And uh, I figured I'd come up and shoot a fast one because my wife and I have been having major difficulties with this iPad. It's claiming that I'm always filled up with uh, filled up with stuff. So therefore, what happened was I think we cleared off all my videos. Oh, well, now there's room on there. I could do videos now, but I cleared all my videos off, like I always do. I have no clue what's going on, guys. Do I need to upgrade on memory? Can somebody help me out there? I don't know. I'm I, I'm I'm not very tech savvy, and it's making me nuts. And also, about going live, um, I did hear that um, you need at least a 1,000 subscribers uh, to, to do that, to go live. Is that a thing or, or what? Um, I didn't try it or nothing. I mean, I'm not real concerned with it, but I thought it would be fun just to, just to do it once. I mean, I, I really don't know. I'm trying to move forth here. Um, it's a new year. And uh, I'm trying to stay in the game. Uh, I, I'd like to stay up into the, uh, in the game here. So we'll get it all squared up and figure it out. And like I said, um, I don't know. Should I change up this backdrop? Should I change? Because I got a mirror right in front of me there. I'm filming in front of a mirror. And this is my wife's uh, bureau. So, I mean, it's not the most ideal thing. So I was wondering if you could give me any ideas about that. On where I should shoot these vids at and really step up you know step up with the big hitters you know what I mean as they say but um I just wanted to go over a couple things quickly um I lost my whole train of thought back to the traditional nights um that's just going to be one of those things guys where I'm going to try and get everything I I'm going to try and I, I know where I want it to be I know where um, I got my uh, knife chest down there, my new knife chest my wife got me. Um, I want to fill that. Now, there's plenty of room in that. I counted that. I could keep some knives in that. I exactly don't know what I want to put in it. I really don't. Um, I, I, I'm, I'm up in the air on what I should stick in that puppy. So maybe you guys could help me out on that. Um, content wise, content wise, this year, it's going to be a long year. And as you guys all know better than me, it's not easy, um, putting content out there and getting in front of a camera every day or every couple days shooting videos. It's not that easy. Um, I mean, the nights run out. I mean, there's only so many things you could show. I mean, what could you show, you know? But um, I do the very best that I can, guys. I try to show you guys things that, I don't know. I always try to show you guys things that are different. Not the same old thing over and over again. Um, I, I don't know. But like I said, if there's anything you guys could help me out with, that would be, you know, like saying in the comments, you know, like, dude, shoot a video on... We'd like to see this or that or that. You know what I mean? That would go a long way. I, I'm, but right now, I'm in the dark. I really don't know which direction to go in. But um, I don't know. We'll get there. We'll eventually get there, guys. And, um, you know, we'll figure it out. So I just wanted to, you know, clarify some things here and going into the new year. Um, you know, so, uh, you know. So we'll, we'll make it, we'll make it entertaining. I'd like to make it fun, entertaining. Um, just a little twist on something else that nobody else is really doing. You know what I mean? Um, I mean, you guys want me to film videos with my shirt off? I could do that. You know, I don't know if you guys want to see me film videos with my shirt off. I, I don't know. You know what I mean? But, um, you guys have to let me know that. So... All right, guys, um, which we call, I got these, I, I want to shoot a video, not now, I want to shoot a video, very important, on all my, these traditional knives I have out here, but I can't do that now, because I am completely exhausted, uh, for number one, and number two, 
the video will get too long. So I got them out. I got them ready. Um, now, naturally, I know you guys don't like these traditional knives. So why I have them out, I really don't know. But I also, off to the side, I have these guys out. Okay? I've got my battle horse knives out, guys. Um, yeah, there they are. Um, so, uh-oh, they're dirty. Oh, boy. Anyway, so yeah, um, I don't know if you guys like battle horse knives, but battle horse knives are my favorite production fixed blade ever. You know what I mean? I just like them. Um, they're right up there with uh, LT Wright, but, um, you know, these guys have a special place in my heart. You know what I mean? They really, really do. And um, that's another thing. Um, I'd appreciate a little comment on, on these, you know? Do you guys like um, battle horse knives? Have you ever heard of them? Which I'm sure of. But do you like them? I mean, they're just... They are just... I tell you, you get a battle horse knife in hand, guys, and it's like, whoa, are you kidding me right now? I mean, they're just <laughs> top-notch piece of cutlery there. I mean, uh, you're not going to be, you know, you can't get, you really can't get a whole lot better than that. Uh, let me try and get that in. A little, a little something there to show you guys. But, yeah, they're my battle horse knives. Now, I've got quite a few of them. I don't really want to show you them. I showed them before, but I don't really want to show you them right now. I want to keep that as a little surprise. Um... But yeah, um, I'm doing everything I can do over here, guys. I'm trying like a like a like a beaner, you know what I mean? Yo, guys, let me know what you think of this. This ha guys, I'm I know fit and finish wise, I'm not really a big big huge um, case guy, but let me try and this case knife that I got yesterday from um, from Tractor supply uh it's an exclusive like i said yesterday to track look at this jigging from tractor supply this is the green jig bone uh the stockman the large stockman and guys when i tell you i have never had a piece of cutlery that was so so gorgeous in my life i mean when i took it out of the case in the store I said, are you kidding me? I mean, guys, it, this, is where, this is where quality should be on all case knives. And I'll just, buy, I'll just about buy every case knife in existence. If they made them like this, there would be major problems. And I would buy just about every single case knife out there on the planet. But they're not like this fit and finish wise. They're just not. But this happens to be the large stockman. And guys, I am so glad I got this piece. I can't stop fondling. I cannot stop fondling. And it's just, I mean, I'm, I'm in my honeymoon. I'm, I'm in the honeymoon uh, stage with it right now, guys. That's what you call honeymoon uh, stage. Because it is that gorgeous. I mean, I, I can't help it. I can't help it. So let me know what you guys think about that piece. Uh, like I said, that's an exclusive. If you guys have a tractor supply near your house, if you do, guys, don't walk. Run into your nearest tractor supply and gobble up that exclusive. I mean, please, do not walk. I'm telling you, is run. But anyway, guys, I just figured I'd show you a look-see on what's coming up and what's going on. You know, we got these guys coming up right here, okay? Let me know what you think about these battle horse knives. They are just unreal. And uh, let me know what you guys think, man. This is, this is stuff that's up and coming, and I'm trying to get off and running here, guys. So please, if you can comment on the video, or if you could comment on something that you'd like to see, something that I'm doing wrong, something that, that could bring... That could bring a lot of fun to the channel. I'll be very, very willing to, to compromise and do that. Alright guys, well for now, I'm going to let you get down the road. And uh, hey, you know what I mean? This is Pete. And uh, 
stick with me. You know, I always say it. You know, I'm trying to get you guys to stay with me all the way through this. And, um, yeah, it's a crazy world out there. And uh, please, shoot me a little comment. Let me know what's going on, guys. I really appreciate it. All right, then. To the next one. All right. Later.